In this video, we will be solving a question on momentum. A compact car with a mass of 725 kilograms is moving at 100 kilometers per hour. First, we will be finding the momentum of the car. The information found in the question is color-coded and presented in the given information box. Here is the diagram representing the car. Our first step would be to convert the units of the velocity given in the question from kilometers per hour to meters per second. Appropriate conversions are made, and we get 27.7 meters per second. To find momentum, we use the formula P equals to M times V. Substitute the appropriate numbers into the equation, and with proper sig figs, our answer arrives to be P equals to 2.01 times 10 to the power of 4 kilograms times meters per second. Part 2 of the question asks, at what velocity is the momentum of a larger car with a mass of 2,175 kilograms is equal to that of the smaller car? The given box contains the color-coded information from the question. A second diagram is drawn, and as the question asks for the velocity of the second car when it has the same momentum as the smaller car, we use the momentum that we calculated in the first part of the question. Once again, we use the formula P equals to M times V. However, we have to isolate the variable we are looking for, in this case, v, by dividing both sides of the question by m. The form of the formula we will be using is v equals to p divided by m. Substitute the given information that we have, and we arrive at an answer of velocity equals to 9.26 meters per second. By converting 9.26 meters per second back into kilometers per hour, we arrive at our final answer with proper sig figs of v equals to 33.3 kilometers per hour.